participating legislators here today. My simple question is, what is your hope for Georgia's children? Do you want us to go in any particular order? Yeah. Whoever wants to go first. Are you, I, well, you know what? Let me go down my list. <laughs> <laughs> Senator Jackson. Uh, sure. I, I hope for you all, for Georgia's children, that we can create a Georgia where you all feel safe, where you feel safe to go to school, where you feel safe to come home, where you have enough food to eat, where you have an education that prepares you well for whatever it is and wherever it is that you decide to go next. I hope for you all to be able to not just dream big, but to achieve big um, and to come up with new things that we can't even begin to imagine today. And so I'm hoping that we can create a Georgia that will give you the foundation that you need in order to achieve those wild, wild, crazy dreams of yours. Thank you, Senator Jackson. Um, Senator Strickland. I could say amen, I agree with all that, but I'll, I'll add this. Um, I hope that that we leave a, a world to you as people that are older than you, where you will continue to do stuff like this, which is um, have open dialogue, um, discuss things openly. And I know that sounds funny, but I feel like we're getting into a world where you can't disagree with each other without not liking each other, without arguing and fighting with each other. And so I hope that um, as policymakers today, we at least leave a world where um, you feel free to think big, dream big, and disagree and compromise with each other um, because you'll have young people ask you the same question one day about the world you're going to be leaving for them behind. Thanks so much. Senator Rahman? I hope big for Georgia. You know what? We have a saying we are the number one state in, in, for business in Georgia. I want to see Georgia number one place for our children to grow. That will be the only wish I have. And I want you to look at any, all these young folks, I want you to look at me. I came from Bangladesh, I'm an immigrant. And there was a time I quit school, I was a dropout. I went to University of Georgia after eight years of quitting school and got my degree. You know, I was a dishwasher when I came in, my first job in this country. I'm a Georgia state Senator. So you know what? I want you all to look at me and say, hey, if this guy can do it, I can do it too. American dream is still alive and well. So we have a better future. And I really hope we can make Georgia number one state for our children. Thank you so much. Representative Clark. So I'll just say that uh, following the senators, it's really difficult because they have great words. <laughs> um, but what I would say is one of my biggest hopes um, for our children is that um, that they never um, uh, let that light that they are providing to the world go out. Right now, what we're doing tonight, um, these questions, um, just the thoughts that are going through our youth's minds. Um, all of this is happening and, and, and y'all are the future. And so I hope that you all continue to engage with us. I hope that you all continue to think um, as deeply and complex um, and, um, and complex about the issues that are affecting you and your life. And I hope that we, um, as the adults in the room, can agree that in the least, we should be investing in our children. We shouldn't be investing in their education. We should be adding to their curriculum and not taking things away. Um, and that uh, we should be, yeah, we should be enhancing and not removing because at the end of the day, um, these, these children, they're different. You all are different. Um, like I said, y'all have opportunities now that I couldn't even dream about when I was your age. And I think that's going to speak volumes for what you will do for the future. And so I just hope that you all keep going, keep at it. What you're doing today matters so much. Keep doing it.